Hey, it's Spoon Phillips at Maury's Music in Coldale, Pennsylvania with a Martin Triple O 42. Oh, yeah. <laughs> These things are gorgeous. Um, beautiful, solid Indian rosewood, top grade Indian rosewood, lovely color variation, straight grain, super fine. Sitka spruce top with wonderful cross silking under the this uh, beautiful aged toner finish. Uh, tortoiseshell pickguard, abalone rosette, spectacular abalone shell inlaid all the way around the edge of the top, including the fret insula, as I like to call it, where the fretboard extends over the top. The antique white binding uh, surrounds this lovely cat's eye snowflake diamond inlay in high color abalone all the way down the fretboard bound headstock uh, gold beautiful gold open back vintage tuners short scale high performance neck one and three quarter inch width down here only two and an eighth here so fast sleek modern high performance taper Nice, low, modified, low oval profile in the back. High gloss neck to go along with the high gloss finish on the body. So really top shelf materials all the way around. Um, and the voice, that lush rosewood undertone, the very complex harmonics, the jewel box, high harmonics over the trebles, those, those angels as I call them, way up high, and I don't know if the mic's going to pick them up or not, but you get these mid-range overtones hovering between the undertone and the high overtones that's just gorgeous. All these plateaus and planes, like strata of cloud, mingling with that fundamental voice, which is really pure, and uh, I mean, just like this, this guitar particularly is a classic triple O 42. So whether you play blues and love that short scale knack for bending the notes, you can get a full step bend with, uh, with um, you know, a full two fret bend out of these things when you're using light strings, or whether you like to, to just have those beautiful strums. Um, very versatile and exceptionally beautiful piece of luthery from C.F. Martin and Company that you can buy right now at Moore's Music. Thank you. 